Morley Notes for 31st August 2021 Jivan Mukti and Jivan Band. That means a life of freedom and a life of bondage. By recognizing God, you attain freedom in one second. Freedom from what? Freedom from the impact of incorrect, untruthful and damaging ideas or messages received from the social attitudes of the patriarchal world, otherwise known as the rule of Ravan. This freedom is your inheritance. The key to claiming the inheritance is to understand the knowledge. God fulfills your search for meaning and clarifies why the world is the way it is. Bhakti, religious devotional practices, is now over and you have the way of knowledge and Raj Yoga. You are in the context of two paternal influences. One is the patriarchal culture of the Iron Age and the other is the Supreme Father, God. The two are in opposition to each other and your path is to manage your way independently of the Iron Aged culture. Sometimes you lose contact with Shiv Baba, incorporeal God. When you maintain all forms of purity, it enables you to maintain contact with Shiv Baba and remain free from the magnetic pull of your past karma which pulls you back into the influence of iron-aged relationships. This is the reason why it is said, do not take sorrow. Celibacy is the key to your freedom. Your purity protects you from the efforts of others to bring you under their influence and diminish you. The weaker someone is spiritually, the more aggressive they are socially and politically. Freedom from the effect of your past experiences enables you to come into your power. The effect of past karma is hard to discern, and the more you intensify your meditation, the more you can discern the effect of your past karma and neutralize it. This is freedom. Coming under the influence of prevailing social attitudes compromised your ability to assert your freedom and independence. Swaraj means independence. Rakshabandhan is the festival that symbolizes your attainment of freedom and independence. Now you know the secret behind this festival. Your mental contact with God, together with your deep understanding of the knowledge, completely dissolve the limitations and control over your mind and sanskaras that your past negative experiences and interactions exert over you. The knowledge of the drama implies that you should not consider these negative experiences mean that you are any less because of them. They are merely scenes in a movie. They do not reflect who you are. You did not deserve them. You purely observed and endured them. God guarantees this. 
for you to achieve independence is equivalent to passing through fire. Something most people do not realize is that their past bad experiences is not because of their past negative karma, but it is mostly because of negative behavior that was inflicted upon you and which you absorbed into yourself. This is equal, if not greater than, any negative action that you may have performed in your life. It is very important to realize that negative karma on your account includes negative behavior that was done to you by other people. Om Shanti